How are you feeling on the bike today, Rose? Right? Awesome. So, so good. That It's just so beautiful. It's really, really nice. How beautiful are these lilies? Ew! Good morning everybody and welcome back to day two of the motorbike tour. Today we have just finished up our stay at the beautiful Blue Wave Resort and I'm heading to go find Roma to see what the plan is for us today while we check out and yeah I'm definitely feeling a little bit sore after yesterday. There is our Jeep, there is Roma. Hello. Our bikes over there, beautiful. What is the plan today, Roma? Today we are riding for 180 kilometers. Yep. Normally without off-road for hours. Yep. Uh, we stop for three or four times. Yep. Uh, three o'clock uh, we are climbing the Lion Rock. Three o'clock we climb Lion Rock. Yeah. Okay, beautiful. Yeah. Awesome. Thank okay, you. I'm thank so excited. You. All right. So you heard it here first, folks. Uh, we are just pretty much riding to the next hotel today for around three or four hours and then we're going to climb the lion rock which i hear is very famous here in Lanka. so very excited to see that very excited to get on the road and start our day oh thank you so this is um it's beautiful thank you very much thank you it's really nice thank, thank you. you so much thank you have a great day let's go the lilies. Wow. Oh, they're so pretty. How are you feeling on the bike today, Riley? Awesome. So, so good. That It's just so beautiful. It's really, really nice. Oh my gosh, everyone. So we're at our first rest stop. We're officially one hour in of the four hours, which is so great. How are you feeling, Dad? Um, uh, good. Again, good. I've only got good. Unless you prepare me, I'm coming up with good. Yeah. So good. Honestly, how beautiful are these lilies? Ew! Ah! Okay. No! The first official mishap oh, of the day. Oh my goodness! Ew! Oh, now, question, ew! Ew, 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 ew. question has to be, is that cow? Oh is my it God. donkey? Dog? I can't believe that. It's big what dog. the hell? Yuck. You know, I was trying to look at the lily. You know, the thing is, try as you might, ew, you'll never ew. really fully get rid of that. That'll be ew. within our, the life of the shoes. Ew. Even the dog doesn't want anything to do with you. Yeah. Oh my God. Oh. This is Riley doing the Sri Lankan moonwalk. There you go. <laughs> Yuck. Oh, horrendous. Anyway, let's look at the lilies here. You go, this is this beautiful lake that we're stopped off at. I'm actually looking at the ground this time, making sure I don't do that again. That was horrendous. I think I'm gonna get some water, sit down for a little bit, relax, and I'll check back in with you when we're heading off or let you know if anything happens while we're here. Hope you're enjoying it as much as I am. The thing I notice about the way they drive here that's different from at home they don't want to stop unless yeah. they absolutely have to. Yeah. So if you're turning, they'll go around you.
guys, we are at stop two. How many kilometers are we in Roma? Uh, 80. 80 kilometers down and how many to go? Uh, now we go to again 100, uh, yeah, 90. 90 to 90. go. Wow, okay. We're about two hours in. Uh, we've got 90 kilometers more to go. So different from yesterday's uh, trip, the sun's not blaring. So it's actually a really pleasant temperature. I'm feeling really good. Um, yeah, I'm loving it. I've got a little bit of music in my AirPod that's making it so enjoyable. And it's just been beautiful scenery. It's so green. I, I just feel so free on the bike. I've missed motorbike riding and just doing a tour like this has just been so amazing. I'm so excited to see our hotel and then go to see the Lion Rock and yeah, keep taking you on this journey. It's so much fun. I hope you're enjoying it. Wow. This is for Wood Dapper. That is Wood Apple. Yeah, that was... Oh Wood my Apple? goodness. Wood Apple. This is Wood Apple from what we were trying to try yesterday. We had the um, the version of it. This is what it looks like. Wow. Yeah. This. this is open. Wow. I was not expecting this. Yeah. Maybe because I had apple in it, I was expecting it to look a little bit more like an apple. And these are peanuts. Yeah, yeah of course. Yeah. Jumbo peanuts. Jumbo peanuts. We have a small one also, madam. Oh, oh yeah, 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 I can this see. This is a small one. The yeah, beautiful. Yeah. Great. Yeah, this is oh, a packet of peanuts. Yeah, yeah, small one. Yep. Please try. Thank you. Oh, try. wow. And open and eat, try. So this is boiled. Boiled one. Can I try one? Yes, yes. Madam, please mm. try. Okay. <laughs> boiled. Mmm. Yum. No, I really like that. I think it just takes, it's a peanut, but the crunchiness is taken out of it, very yeah. much like what dad said. It's good though. You know, I definitely you prefer the hard one ones for sure. Rubbish. Yeah, I definitely want to um, buy a wood apple. Yeah, for sure. Are these, do you reckon these are the right ones? They kind of look weird. How can you tell which one's ripe? Like, yeah, it is good smell. Good smell? It, uh, open. Yeah. Inside, uh, uh, fruit. Inside yeah. is a fruit. Yeah, yeah. Is that one a good smelling one? Yeah. No. This no, one. not that one. That one is okay? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. Can I buy this to try? You can you break open for me, please. Sorry. 10 rupees. <laughs> only 10 rupees. 10 rupees and peanuts as well? Peanut, uh, this packet, 100. Okay, yeah. Could we get one of those packets as well, please? Okay. And would you be able to cut the um, wood apple for me? Okay, okay. So I can eat now? I'm going to add a bit to it. Wow. Yes, it's <gasps> good. Oh my goodness. It's okay. It looks like meat. Wow, thank you so much. Thank you. Um, wow. It looks like meat, doesn't it? Taste vinegary? Yeah. Mm. I was not expecting the fruit to look like this. Apparently it's super popular here. Smells... Tart. Yeah. It smells so weird. I've never... Has anyone seen a fruit like this? This is so weird. Okay. Oh, gross. It feels like mushy and... Cheers. It's a bit sour. But it tastes like fruit, but it just has the weirdest texture. And if you can see, there's like light bits and then darker bits. So this is a lighter bit. It just, I don't know if you're supposed to eat with your hands or not, but it feels wrong. Um, it tastes a bit like a pear. I think I would describe it as like a sour pear, but the texture's not like a pear at all. And you've got these little seed things in there that I'm not sure if you're supposed to eat them, but they have a really crunchy flavor. It doesn't taste like the ice block we tried yesterday. The ice block was very overly sweet. I think the texture is really throwing me off. I'm so glad we tried it though. It just looks like a bit like dog food or pulled pork or pulled beef or something. What a great experience. Let's pay for these and the peanuts and let's get back on the road. Thank you for that. Thank you, sir. Thank you. And I only have like 100 or 1000. You have change for 1,000? No, no, no. So it's 100 and 
10? Uh, 100 enough for now. 10 or only. No, I will go get 10. I have another. No, um, no, no, 100 enough. Thank you so much. Thank you. Should we just give him 1,000 as well? And there is Tip. Okay, thank you. Lovely to meet you. Thank okay. you. Have a nice day. Thank you, you okay. too. Thank you. Lovely to Bye -bye. meet you. Okay guys, I don't know if you can see, but it is hot. I'm sweating now. The sun is out with a vengeance. We're gonna get back on our bikes now. We're gonna start the remaining two hour leg. I'll check back in with you at our next stop. <sighs> I'm gonna be really sweaty by the next stop. I can already tell. Whew. Did you see me trying to change? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Swap. It's it's locked. Like I couldn't go up. Go okay, guys. So there's been a little bit of drama in the villa. Um, while I was riding, my clutch locked and oh. it won't go to second anymore. So we've had to pull over, have an emergency stop. We have Roma looking at it right now. How is it locked? It um, won't change up, will it? It's yeah. locked at first. Yeah, yeah. It's locked here. Uh, do you know how to fix? Yeah, first I'll call them our mechanic. Okay, and, uh, beautiful. So it's not my bad driving. I was like, why can't I turn back up to second when we went through that roundabout? And um, it was just locked at first and I couldn't get past neutral. But it turned out to be a real issue, which always makes me feel better. Um, but it's also inconvenient because we have a little bit of a stall now while he calls the mechanic and tries to fix it. But yeah, that's just an update for you all. Not everything goes to plan. Let's all get a drink and we're probably just gonna Hello. kick back here for a little bit and I'll update you with what the verdict is and if he can fix it. All right, everyone. So the verdict is in and apparently the mechanics in the area that we've broken in are not very knowledgeable about the Royal Enfield bikes. So my dad is going to be riding the white bike in first until we can find a mechanic that can fix it. Otherwise, we might do the rest of the hour and a half drive. He's going to be in first, which is going to suck a little bit, but it is what it is. We have to get to the hotel. Big shame. It's so disappointing. Um, but I will be on the green bike now. We'll be going a lot slower, so I don't know if that will extend our um, trip time. I also realized when I took a break how dirty my face has gotten from all of the dust that's been kicking up behind cars. Like, I just look so dirty. Um, and yeah, there's just so much soot on my face. I'm specifically not wearing anything on my face other than sunscreen because um, I'm just gonna sweat it off anyway. All right, let's keep going and hopefully dad fares well. I think we're gonna trial it for half an hour and then just see what, what to do. So wasn't expecting this problem, but you gotta be ready for anything when you travel. And I'm glad that we're hopefully gonna sort it out today. <laughs> Do you want to swap back? Um, yeah, I'm happy either way. Right, I don't mind. Might as well. All right, sweet. Woo. So lunch break, you said is in 30 minutes? Uh, 30 oh, 30 kilometers. kilometers. How many minutes is that? 40. 40. Okay, sweet. Oh. So this road is nice, no? The road is so nice. It's really beautiful. Yeah, really beautiful. Um, yeah, the gear kicked back for dad while he was riding the bike. So uh, both bikes are good again. It just naturally fixed itself so he can change gears so i was on the green bike i'm going back to the white bike now uh taking a five minute break it's really really pretty here there were so many beautiful like rivers and stuff 
that we passed and bridges we oh, went over. Yeah. It was amazing. Yeah. Lovely. I'm, I'm, I really love the countryside. It's, it's very yeah. nice. Yeah. Honestly, for everyone doing a bike tour, have I would recommend music so much because it just goes by so much quicker, but it's also so much more enjoyable when you've got a tune, you can have a little bit of a dance. Um, really makes a difference. Anyway, I'm gonna get a drink, gonna relax for five minutes, and then we'll get back on the road. spot one thing I want to show you with how dirty it is look at my arm you can see all the dirt in the crease of my elbow that's like all the dirt and soot that's all over my face um, all over my body from just what's kicking up in cars um, but yeah we're at lunch gonna go get something to eat I'm exhausted I'm very thirsty I'm very hungry um, oh also the other thing that I keep forgetting to mention is your lips get really chapped from the wind. The wind, my lips are super dry, so I also need to get lip balm. Let's go get lunch, I'm so excited. Oh wow, I love it. It's super busy here, so I will not be vlogging in this super busy public place. I'm going to enjoy my lunch and I'll let you know my thoughts when we're back on the bikes. Oh my goodness, guys. Lunch was absolutely delicious. It was so good. The buffet was just really, really nice. Uh, the food was warm, but just delicious. It had such a great flavor to it. We're half an hour away from our hotel. And yeah, how, are you, how was lunch for you, Dad? Uh, it's good. <laughs> He did say if I didn't give him warning, he was just going to say good every time. So that's my own fault. Um, all right, we're getting back on our bike. And let's keep this show on the road. Woohoo! Awesome day, thank you. Again. Awesome. All right, everyone, we are at our hotel. I'm gonna go through the check-in process. I will show you a room tour when we check in to our room. See you soon. We got these towels given to us by reception and we've both just wiped our hands and face. Here, take a seat. Very, very dirty. All right, so it turns out we are in at the wrong hotel and this is not the place that we are staying. So we need to get back on our bikes and drive to a second hotel. This one looked so beautiful though. So, so lovely. So uh, no room tour yet. It was literally the hotel next door. Um, yeah, it looks the reception Lovely. looks less nice. First impressions. Um, Let's go check out the rooms. Wow. Wow, okay. When I said it might not be as nice, you've got giant chests over there, and then the pool, and the rock that we will be visiting super, super soon is right there. Oh my gosh, this place is amazing. 
How beautiful is that? Yeah. After first? I'm back before dark. Before dark? Yes. Okay. Thank you very much. Beautiful. Thank you, sir. Nice. All right, room tour. Beds are connected, which is a bit of a shame. Water, tea, coffee. Um, Thank you, sir. Then you have this beautiful beer. All right, guys, that was the room tour. Now we are heading to this Lion Rock. I'm going to go meet up with my guide. We left this morning at 8.30 a.m. It's now 3.30. And it feels so non-stop, but I booked in seven o'clock massages, which will be really nice. So I'm gonna go hike this rock. Was, I think he said it was an hour. And then I'm looking forward to being back here for sunset, have a little bit of a swim, have a massage. And I feel like that's the perfect way to end the day after a full day of riding. There is our Jeep. Ready to go? Okay, amazing. I can sit in the front. Woohoo! I'm so excited, I get to finally sit in the front seat of this beautiful car. Uh, I'm ready for an adventure. Ooh. Yay! So, Lion Rock. Yes. The climb is one hour? Uh, one hour, one and a half hour. One and a half hours to climb? Yeah. Oh my goodness, okay. And what is around there? Are there animals and stuff we will see or just the rock? Yeah, just the rock. Okay. Yeah. Beautiful. More steps. What is this rock famous for? Just the height? Uh, uh, just the height and uh, this is for the world, world heritage site. It's a world heritage site. Wow. Yeah. All right, let's get this journey started. After four hours of riding, we are now gonna do an hour and a half of walking. And if I were to say I wasn't exhausted, I would be lying. Um, I am super, super tired. And I was really tossing up when we got to the hotel, if it would be worth it to come and do this hike. I decided I'm here, so I may as well do it. With the amount of cars here behind me, it looks really, really popular. So I definitely think we've made the right choice. I've made the right choice to come. Dad decided to stay, he had work to do. Um, but I'm really looking forward to seeing the view from up on the rock, hoping that it's all worthwhile. And that this walk isn't too strenuous and we can do it and get down in record time. They have a whole board of things that we might be able to see. So we could see elephants, leopards, pangolin, flying fox, land monitor, weird. Hopefully we see elephants. I'd love to see a leopard. I assume that's really rare. Um, from a safe distance, obviously I don't want to get eaten. But there's a monkey all the way over there already. Now it's a we can buy the ticket, entrance ticket. We have to buy entrance ticket? Yeah. Okay. That is what it costs. 11,000 rupees. That's expensive. Oh, you got the ticket already? Yeah, yeah. Oh, amazing, thank you. Great. So ticketing is done. It was like 36 US, which honestly, I'm a little bit surprised with um, how expensive Sri Lanka is. I feel like I was definitely not expecting that in comparison to like Nepal, India, um, Indonesia. So yeah, to climb, do an hour and a half trek to cost almost 65 Australian and 36 US. Uh, definitely surprised me a little bit. So that's interesting if you want to plan your trip, but hopefully the trek's worth it. The tour that my father booked, this experience was included in it. So it's not out of pocket for me. Dad's already paid for that, uh, even though he's not joining us. So if you're wondering why I didn't buy my own ticket, that is the reasoning behind it. Hello. Thank you so much. Istuti. Istuti. I keep thinking that's it. And then I'm scared to say it because I'm scared I'm going to get it wrong. Oh. For, oh my gosh, lilies are everywhere that I have noticed here. You can kind of see um, the light rain padding on the river here. It's quite refreshing. Crocodiles here. 
There are crocodiles in here. Three, three four crocodiles. <gasps> Has anyone been eaten by one? Yeah. Oh my gosh, it's eaten someone. Yeah. Okay, if you're a tourist here, don't jump yeah, in the lake. Really sure. More crocodiles here. There's more crocodiles here. Oh my gosh. Hello, monkey. Have you ever seen a leopard here? No. No. <laughs> no. By that reaction, I'm hoping that we don't see a leopard here. <laughs> uh, everything here is wild, isn't it? Wild. Yeah. yeah, okay. So we have to be careful as tourists. Wow. Oh, yeah, up there. Yes. Is that the viewpoint where we're walking to? Yes. So that one just there. So we will not be walking all the way to the top where the grass is. It is yeah. just like that little... The thing that's carved into the rock halfway through. All right, we're approaching the bridge now. What are these things here? Hello, yeah. sir. Safety box. They are safety box. Secret box. Oh, it's sacred box. Yeah. You try wow. to open. I try and open. Oh. Yeah, how do you open it? It seems... To find out. Find out. Oh, my gosh. Well, I assume that's the cutout. Yes, yeah, right. Oh, my gosh, there's stuff... <laughs> There's stuff in it. It's a technique. <laughs> there is technique. Yes. Oh. Then, I, f I feel like it's going to be one of those you break it, you buy no, it situations. No, 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 no. If oh you my break goodness. It, I that. <laughs> oh. <right. laughs> oh my goodness. Then I tell you this door then, coming out this way, no? And then and door little, comes out. Little down. Little. Oh my goodness. Then open. This is the most. Imp oh, and then that open yeah. now. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. You can take out all the way, no problem. You can take out all the way, wow. And you make these? Yes, you we make. have six families, we make these things. Six families, wow. We have a small carpentry village. That is crazy. That's, and then slide it back on. Sliding, yes. Wow, how much do you sell for? This one, you give me 9,000 rupees. 9,000, wow. And this also you can open. And then this one, and it opens similar as well, similar, the top. Similar, yes. And but what do people usually store in them? Are they... You know, those days, these things made out of rock for rock, the jewellery. No, for jewellery no and bank, stuff? No. Oh, okay. They put the treasure, something like this. Yeah, box. beautiful. I, oh. on it, I, I don't have 9,000. I, I didn't bring enough cash. No, I only no. have card, which is a number one travel mistake. <laughs> but no thank problem. you for educating me. That is amazing. <laughs> and this one has three. Two. Wow. Oh my goodness. And oh my, and then they put your earrings and stuff. Wow, oh, I love that so much. You're amazing and hopefully <laughs> someone can watch this and come yeah, prepared okay. with money. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. That. Thank you. Lovely to meet you. Your name is? Sudad. Sudad. Nice to meet you. I'm Riley. Have a great day. Thank, Thank you for showing me. Um, look at the just monkeys and wow. Yay. I'm glad that there's a little bit of shade coming up. So I can get a bit of rest in the sun. How are you feeling? Are you tired or are you fit little, for this? Little tired. Little tired, yeah. It's been a big day. It's been a massive day. It is not much nicer than what I was expecting. I wasn't expecting all of this. It is really, really lovely. Apparently they're too noisy. It's gonna be wasps. That's crazy. Where do the wasps live? Upstairs. In the rock or in tree? In the rock. In the rock. Wow. We have a long way to go. Standing. Oh my gosh. Wow. Look at all the moss. These stairs are also. They fit like half of my foot. They are really small. You can see people all the way up there. So you're up there, then up that spiral staircase. And I think you're at the summit. I don't know. Let's keep going. It's going to be easier going down. So I'm keep re repeating to myself. Oh. All right, guys. So that spiral staircase there leads up into a museum that's for like water painting and stuff no filming in there i personally have seen a million and one museums in my life and i'm 
exhausted after a huge day so we're just gonna go straight to the summit and the viewpoint I don't want to get caught here after dark so Roma that is that is museum and this is yeah. straight to the viewpoint beautiful yeah. <laughs> <laughs> viewpoint check we were just down there a tiny bit ago so green continuing on these stones are so slippery as well oh my goodness honestly I think I'm gonna have to chuck out these jeans with how much I'm sweating right now it just feels wrong definitely don't do what I did and put exercise gear on if you're doing this we have all of that still to go hopefully someone watching this can see it through my point of view and decide if they want to do this on their trip or not um, and if they're fit enough for it because coming in with zero expectations weirdly I was thinking this walk was gonna be a lot quicker but I'm gonna go sit down have a rest and also don't do what I did and bring a water bottle for oh my goodness I need a water so bad Okay guys, I've just had a little bit of a rest and Roma has researched for me how many stairs we are walking up and this rock, it is 1,200 steps, which is just easily... Just now we're walking 800. Right now we've just walked 800, oh my goodness. So 400 more stairs, but in total 1,200. We left at the hotel at 3.30, it's now 4.30, so it's already been an hour. I'd say we were walking up for like... 45 minutes so many people so much traffic oh it's got rain in my eye the rain makes it kind of cool and i'm glad that the sun's behind some clouds so it's not as harsh but yeah it's gonna be a little bit of a slow one walking up now because there's a bit of a traffic jam because you go up and down kind of in the same way it's probably at this point in the journey where i wish that they just had a little basket that i could sit in and they could just uh, kind of winds me all the way up like an elevator oh my gosh there's more people over there on that rock oh that breeze is so lovely yeah the wind is definitely making um, this a lot nicer I'm so glad dad didn't come because he is afraid of heights and I feel like he would be absolutely terrified right now <gasps> the wasps! Yeah, I can see. All the way there. Wow. And there's a monkey here. Hello. I'm starting to feel a little bit yuck at the idea of so many people on the same stairs at once. It's been here for many years, but it's always a first time for it to break, and I'm praying that today is not the day. Oh, hi, monkey. Hopefully he doesn't jump on me. Don't make eye contact. Uh, I feel like they're growling at me. Uh, I don't want to be attacked. I, look at them following, they're still coming. I used to really love monkeys. Until I got punched in the face by one. And now, and it hissed like they're scary when they hiss at you. There's another rock. Biturangala. The monkey mafia are officially gone. And I think we're all the way at the top. We're almost there, everyone. Wow. Oh. Holy crap. We've done it. Last one. The last one. Okay. Wow. Yeah. Look at that. Look at those views. We've done it. I feel accomplished. And there are really beautiful views. I'm also very exhausted. And we've just got such greenery. Sri Lanka is so lush. And you see that in um, the bike tour that we did today as well. Like there's just so much greenery here which is really beautiful to just be all a part of nature 
We've got dogs up here. I don't know how they made the million squillion stair walk, but I don't really know what to do when you get to the top of a hike. Just enjoy it for five minutes and then head back down. Great, go me, go us. Now we're here. All right, everyone. I've taken 101 photos from my Instagram up here because you can't hike if no one knows you did it. Um, and everyone needs, my caption will definitely mention 1,200 steps as a flex because I'm not a hiker. Um, it's currently 4.54 and yeah, we probably get down around, yeah, five. Uh, we'll be down at six. Hopefully the sun doesn't set. Okay, so I've been told it is slowed down because these rocks can get really slippery um, and they're small. Oh my gosh. You can kind of see here, I have probably a size nine foot, um, size nine to 10 in women's, which I think is US seven in men's. Um, and yeah, it's like some steps are half my foot, some of them are a little bit bigger, but you definitely want to be a little bit careful and cautious when going down something so steep. Wow, that's so beautiful. After 5.30 they close, so no one can climb in dark? Uh, the climb starts 5.30 a.m. and close 5.30 p.m. 5.30 a.m. people climb up here? Yeah. When does sunrise in Sri Lanka? Yeah. Mm. 6 a.m. Okay, beautiful. So they, some people can kind of be somewhere high by the time the sun rises. All right, I'm not going to say anything interesting because I'm so concentrated on not slipping. Like, look how small that one is. Um, yeah, I'm nervous about slipping, but super, super beautiful. Uh, the last tree of the walk. Yeah. Everywhere I hear the webs. Uh, webs? Uh, like spider? Uh, house. Oh, wasps. wasps yeah. Oh, many years, three years ago, did you say? Yeah, yeah. There were wasps all around here. Sometimes they attack. Attack tourists. Oh, yeah. Wow, so did they remove? Yeah. They move. Wow. Uh, yeah. Yeah. We're on the slippery steps again. They are so small. So Roma actually said there was an option of hiring a guide. So there's a lot of history about this place. I saw someone talking about ancient paintings kind of into the rocks and stuff. So this place has a huge history. It's a World Heritage Site for a reason. So uh, I opted not to hire a guide for this just because I wanted to walk up, I wanted to see the view. Yeah, I just thought it would be much easier just the two of us to take on this adventure alone. And I'm glad I did, but definitely if you want to learn more about this place and you want to know more about the history, then there is an option at an additional cost to hire a guide. The car park is now practically empty and as we head back to the hotel i'm gonna wrap up this video thank you so much for joining me today i hope you enjoyed it as much as i did i'm so much looking forward to tomorrow and next week you will be seeing a safari tour i heard that they're not that great in sri lanka so i hope to be proven wrong and we get to see lots of animals i appreciate your presence let me know in the comments what you'd like to see me do next and yeah check back in with you then riley out i also just want to note that my legs are shaking from the exhaustion because I have not walked or done that much exercise in a very long time and I'm going to be feeling it tomorrow but um, yeah it's just been so much fun I'm really really loving Sri Lanka I think it's so beautiful and I can't wait to see even more tomorrow